Hello guys, Game Changers back again bringing you a pretty great video today to show you how to stop software updates and revokes from happening on your iOS device. So guys, uh, as you'll see now, I have got the software update on my thing ready to be done. Um, this method actually works from iOS 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12 and 12.1. 12 um, so yeah, let's get into this pretty much. Uh, so what you're going to need to do, there will be a link to get an Apple ID down below in the description. You want to go onto there, go onto the Apple ID and download AdGuard Pro from the Apple ID that we are thinking. Uh, this was only made possible by the way by Kpanic, his Twitter and YouTube will be down in the description. You want to wait the 30 seconds, it'll tell you how to set it up. You want to go and set it up before you go on to the next step. And give me a second and I'll go and set, set it up. So yeah, for this bit, you do actually want to just keep it on system default. Um, I was messing around on this bit a lot because I've seen my friend's tutorial, he used the CS method, but it's not the CS method. You don't need to do that, that's only for actually blocking ads out. So you want to go down to Safari. This is to set up the actual ad guard, and then you want to turn it on in the Safari on the content blocker section. So yeah, then when you come back on here, as you can tell, I put it back on system default and I back out of here. And then I go on to the filters, but you don't need to do anything there. I'm just checking for a certain section to check where I got on you. So as I go up, turn the status off because you've just set up the DNS. This is the part I wanted to see, blacklist and whitelist. Only because it's the blacklist part that you will have to copy and paste all the links on the website that I will provide below onto there as well. As you can see, update is still there at the moment. That's because we haven't finished yet guys, I'm just showing you that it is there. So as you can see, it's iOS 12.1 update. So you want to go off of here. You want to go on to Safari. Well, I say go on to Safari. I already got it here. But down below in the description will be a link straight to this. You want to copy and paste all of this into the blacklist that we were on about 20 seconds ago. As you can see, I open it up. I'm on the blacklist. You want to tap and then paste all of these in there and press done. And then you come back out. As you can see here, if I go on software software update, it will not work. It'll pop up saying error finding update. Uh, this is basically what I mean by blocking out software updates. This is a great way to do it. And don't forget, this also stops revokes. That's why there's so many links that you are add to the blacklist. So any third party apps that you got installed should not get revoked at all. Uh, this was, like I said in the beginning, this was found by Kpanic, a good friend of mine. Make sure to go and check him out. His Twitter and YouTube will be in the description below. Um, that's pretty much for me. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to comment, subscribe and like. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.